Yo, what's good, family? It's your boy, JB. Listen, we are at the championship game, the finals, whatever you want to call it. We playing West Virginia, man. We went on a 5-0 streak. You feel me? I made it this far, man. Just like the video. You feel me? Y'all been following this. You know what I'm saying? We playing West Virginia. I don't know how much I'm going to drop. We're going to cross that bridge later. You feel me? But if y'all new to my channel, make sure y'all go ahead and subscribe, man. Hit the notification bell. You feel me? Because we drop bangers on the regular. You feel me? Let's get into it. Look, I'm pretty young for this game, coach. I might even go lie to you. <laughs> All right. So we'll take it above a nine for now, okay? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. We need a lot of energy. You print straight hand man in the paint. Can't have you running out of gas early. Hey, yo, look, that dude, he like Zion thick. Like, I don't know how he jumped with all that muscle. The defies the laws of physics. But I still need you to go at him. I mean, I still need you to draw the defense in, which opens up the offense for everyone else. Right. Not an easy assignment, but it is what it is. Hey, look, I mean, the pressure only going up. I might as well get used to it, right? Yeah, at this level, you gotta have both skills and mental fortitude. Each is just as important as the other. Yeah, for sure, for sure. <sighs> all right. All right, come on, head over the court. Put you through some drills. Only one obstacle remains. An epic journey is nearly complete. The moment has arrived. The pinnacle of the postseason, right here, right now. Showtime, 96. Hello and welcome to 2K Sports' presentation of the College Basketball Championship Tournament Finals. I'm Forrest Hunt, joined by Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. We're glad to have you with us. And in our matchup tonight, we'll see the West Virginia Mountaineers going up against the UCLA Bruins. And the work MP has done to get the Bruins this far has been very impressive. He's hungry to win the championship. You can see it. And Greg, give us your take on West Virginia. Well, this team looks to make the most of the inside presence of Prince Strahan. They will almost always have a size advantage inside. And will try to leverage that on both. Next time he sits down, Coach is going to have a few choice words for him with that shot selection. Saw the finals in 1959. That makes this a history-making moment for them. A lot of pressure on these young players tonight with the possibility of the school's first title in the balance. So rare now for a school to win even. Really can't teach that at any level. And an unprecedented feat by this group. They'll be the first team since 1997 to have the chance to beat three number one seeds in the tournament. It's for a school. To be able to get by two number one seeds is already tough enough. Shows you just how talented this group is. And that one is good. This team has made the most out of his interior presence. Here's Bell, guarded by Pearson. Inside, and the dunk by MP. And the athleticism on full display. When MP throws one down. Dog run has them as the fan favorites. We, you know how we all like to cheer for the underdog. They've busted brackets, but every neutral hoop fan wants to see oh, the eight seed succeed. Adams, no good on the shot, a bit long that time. Here's Kelly. Yes. And it's MP picking up the assist. Institution for West Virginia. Here's Tavares. Started by McGee. Shots good by Tavares. And for this school, they've captured the attention of Hoop fans across the globe. It's really been as special of a tournament as any I've ever seen, and I've seen a bunch of them. They still have a chance to put a period at the end of this incredible score. He can't get that one. So the Bruins will take it the other way. From deep, MP. And the Bruins hit again from deep. And the defense. Clock at six. Over McGee. Throws it down as the official calls the foul. It may be a three-point play. At the line for the Mountaineers. He goes on Jones. Hey, you got to give Pearson credit. Recognizing the overcommitment 
and then taking advantage of that to burn the defense. MP drives in, and the dunk by MP. Yeah. We're seeing some fireworks from him all. Mr. Clutch himself, who played back in the late 50s. Jones, good, and the assist goes to MP. Expanding his range, Weaver uses the glass to finish the layup. Stevenson. But to have that effort and will for second chance people. And here's McGee. And here's FP outside. And another three for UCLA. Something you gotta love and the inside. Hernandez. Sheldon with a block. To the middle. Here's Martin. Good. And the assist goes to MP. Controlled by his size. But ultimately it's going to be about fit more than anything else. And it's Kelly with the jam. Boy, there's not much defense available once a steal is made. That's the best time to attack on the break. And slam dunk by Strahan. Going downhill, it was a wrap. And with Strahan, he's not the most mobile big man. That has some teams worried about taking him too high. Ultimately, I think he goes. Good work defensively by Adams. You know what? His finishing ability, not really at the level that you would expect. But he's going to have to start playing with more force. An incredible program and never make it all the way. Now here's Kelly. They lead by the largest margin of the game, 25. A nice shot by MB. Bottom line, you need shooters on from long range. You're doing your team a disservice if you aren't shot hungry. Strahan, foul called that time on the way up. That'll give him two chances at the free throw line here. Third team foul. It's going to go on Sheldon. You know, when you look at Prince Strahan, hard for the word enforcer. So a pretty lopsided game through the first half. The Bruins on top, opening up a huge gap. West Virginia Mountaineers, 17. Welcome back to 2K Sports' presentation of Championship College Basketball. With the first half behind us, we are on to the second, where this year's champions will be decided. Hernandez's shot's off. UCLA with the ball. Down low. Adams. Nice pass. Let it perfectly a commanding lead. And it really gives them the opportunity to give their starters a rest. All in. This could get even more out of hand if they continue to put up points. What a performance we are seeing. And MP throws it down. Right now. Strahan with the ball. Working on Sheldon. Defensive foul, Owen Sheldon. That's his third personal foul. First team foul. At the line for the Mountaineers, Prince Strahan taking two shots. Both shots good from the stripe. Both teams changing it. They've taken the initiative. They've played, I think, with more purpose so far. And it is with the ball. Now guarded by MP. That shot wide open. The defense has to respect him from the mid-range. Inside. Terrific assist and nice finish. Solid play all around. That one certainly should make the highlight reel. Steps back. Here's Paul. Laid in with a nice touch off the glass. Launches a three. That one is off. And UCLA goes the other way with it. On the wing, MP. Guarded by Hernandez. A nice shot by MP. Zero hesitation there from MP. So confident in his jumper, ready to fire at all times. And the shot is good. Yeah, well done to finish that one off. What a run it's been for MP and his school. They have the lead, and it's all but said and done. They are going to be your national champions. And what an unlikely run. As crazy a journey as we've ever seen. This team believed in their abilities and peaked at the right time. And this performance is going to open up eyes all around the country. You figure the stars like MP have greatly boosted their draft stock. What a storybook finish for an all-time great team of this school. That's it, folks. The UCLA Bruins have won it all. Wow. 
I mean, we almost could have given them the trophy at halftime as well as they played. They certainly put one heck of a bow on this impressive tournament run with that major lopsided win. And you know pro scouts are salivating at MP's complete dominance in the biggest game of the year. He's on his way to a Hall of Fame career, folks. And so that's the end of the stunning college basketball tournament. And the end of our broadcast. This is Forrest Hunt, along with Clark Kellogg and Greg Anthony. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next year. Woo! <laughs> Yo, this is a beautiful sight, bro. Ain't it, man? Yo, you know, this This is going to make me so much money. <laughs> oh, man, look, I knew you was the moose, but I think you're going to turn on me this soon. Rick, your heart broke you, bro. Oh, man. <laughs> get up there, buddy. Yo, get up there, bro. Woo! You know what you do. You're yeah, about to bust the move, bro. Oh, 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 oh. Both of those boys, bro. Like, don't you come up with that? Ah, look. You're killing me, <laughs> Jim. Champion! 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 Dog walking through. How's it feel to be the MP? YouTube star turned collegiate legend. Man, honestly, I feel great, bro. <laughs> <laughs> hey, does it feel as great as you thought it was gonna feel when I caught you practicing taking down the net with your little step stool? With that oh, you're just never gonna bedroom? let me forget that story, huh, bro? <laughs> nah, man. Hey, you know what? I respect that. <laughs> hey, 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 for real though. You been thinking at all about next steps? Bro, always. That's what I'm talking about. So where's your head at? Cause you know I got a million ideas about how we could leverage where we're at now, but. You know, I want to know what you're thinking before I push the button on anything. Okay, so what you think about the G League? What about it? You think it's a good option for us or what? Are you feeling all right? Bro, you are a guaranteed lotto pick. Why would you even want to go to the G League? Gee, the G League, they doing good stuff right now. Everybody talking about how they helping players work on their game. Pro tools for the NBA, okay, bro. yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a good option for guys that don't want to go to college, sure. But, dude, you went to school. You're draft eligible, plus you did so well in college that you are a guaranteed lotto pick. They can make me better. Okay, but honestly, in good conscience, I can't advise you to go to the G. I hate you. Let me think about it. Honestly, I'm thinking about the draft, bro. Like, the NBA is right around the corner. I can taste it. As you should be. You're a lotto pick. Easy. So this is the decision you would make if you was me? I can't tell if you're joking, bro, but yes. You have a chance to be a lotto pick in the NBA. That's going to make all of our dreams a lot easier to realize. No doubt about that. Yeah, buddy. Let's do it. Yo, so real talk, what you think about Chris Brickley? I mean, he cool. He's got a lot of great connections. I mean, I heard good things about his workouts. Cool, because I'm thinking about training with him. You know, get my draft stack up a bit. You know, get in the competition. Yeah, I mean, that's an option. But it could hurt your draft stock, too. I mean, if you're not playing at the top of your game. You trying to say, bro, go snitch on me? <laughs> if I'm not good? <laughs> like, I know you're kidding, man. But... No, I'm not kidding. I'm being serious. I mean, word does get around, bro. Look, I know you think he's gonna kill whatever workout he throws at you, but I just want you to know it goes both ways. I think you should just know what you're getting into before you commit. I hear you. Okay. I feel like I got a lot to think about, man. Yeah, you do. But you also got a lot of people who care about you. Don't feel like you gotta make this decision on your own. Yo, for sure. I appreciate you, bro. When you ready to make moves, let me know. Hey, 